A glittering and meaningful occasion. And all week long, the football chatter has centered around this game and these talented teams. Which one will outwit the other in a stadium both packed and passionate? So many questions to be answered on a day of destiny. We're live on EA TV. Hello, it's great to be with you, and our venue for this game is the Estadio El Sadar. My name is Derek Ray, and my commentary partner, as usual, is Stuart Robson. And we're focusing on, technically speaking, one of the best leagues in the world. I'm talking, of course, about La Liga. It's Osasuna, and they... Oh, and that challenge carried with it quite the element of risk. Now, what's the referee going to do next? And the early shower, this is going to be a real test of their mettle. Well, it's a straight red, and rightly so. But how will they replace him? They've got to reorganise now. May following the free kick and he was able to hang on to the ball Valverde this is Kroos so plenty of forward momentum from Real Madrid here that is tackling of the highest order Mojica. Well, he's lost it. And teammates to play it to. And just blotting out the danger. Well, he's given us away. Now, who can he play it to? Be disappointed if he didn't take that one cleanly. Aurelien Chouameni. Well, Real Madrid have real know how when it comes to preventing goals, and the record backs that up, Stuart. Well, they've been so hard to break down this season, and key to that has been the centre back combinations. They've looked so assured, they've been excellent right from the start. The danger not over. Took a and touched onto the frame of the goal. Beautifully weighted ball. Bellingham! Oh, a smart stop. Well, they have the ball once more. Tony Kroos. Plenty of players waiting in the middle. Vinicius Jr. Now with Valverde. Oh, genuine chance. Marvellous anticipation. And fired over by Kroos. Cutting the ball back. Oh, could be an opportunity here. Tony Kroos. And Bellingham, well read to put an end to that attack. And to Budimir. How about the cross? Can they forge ahead? He needs to get this one away. And it's gone behind for the corner. Going short.
Well, that's how to do it inside your own penalty area. The through ball. Textbook closing down, and now they're on the attack. Can he give them the advantage? And able to close down the shots. I think the referee was spot on there. A free kick in the end after he had attempted to play advantage. Well, not giving him any breathing room. Ruben Peña. Oros. In a position from which they could potentially... In it goes! The opening goal in this contest! Well, he wasn't going to waste this chance. 1v1 against the keeper, and he slots it away with great confidence. That's a good finish. Well, there you have it. Angelotti's team are struggling at the moment. So the action continues. Will there be a quick response from Real? Eder Militao. Rudiger. Now, Eder Militao. David Alaba. Jude Bellingham. And Real's creative tendencies coming to the fore. Well, not coming close to hitting the target from there. Well, he hasn't quite had the impact and attack that we were expecting, Stuart. Yeah, you're right. He needs to impose himself on this game. He just hasn't done enough to get away from his marker so far. Unless that changes, they're going to struggle to turn this one around. Toro. Mojica. And winning it back. Jude Bellingham. Tony Kroos. And he's won the ball. And to Budimir. Nicely timed tackle. Well, getting close to the half-time interval with Real Madrid behind. What have you made of it so far, Stuart? Well, it's been a tight first half so far, but they haven't quite shown enough guile in the attacking third. If, however, they can be more... Denied by the bar. Back in play here. And Bellingham. On to Alaba. Of course. And back to course. Opportunity to deliver the cross. Will he finish? And there it is! The equaliser! Down to ten men, but showing guts and determination. Well, I have to say, he's done really well here. He's in the right place, and then a decent finish. That's a good goal. Well, they needed that, and so did he. Just look at the manager's relief there. Well, there it is. The first half has come to an end here at El Sadar. So they get the ball rolling in the second half. Even Steven here. So little to choose between the sides.
Real Madrid coming away with it. Not a poor touch and unable to keep it in play. Throw in to come. Aymar Oroz. He's trying to create something. And the keeper more than equal to the task. An opportunity to forge ahead from this corner situation. Can someone get on the end of this? Not out of the woods yet. Oh, tremendous goalkeeping. Offside, not that anyone knew. Federico Valverde. On the ball, Rudiger. Doing well to win it back. What can they do from here? Can he put them in front? Well, it was a wonderful chance, but the goalkeeper comes through. Yes, Derek, we have to give credit to the keeper, but surely he should have scored there. That's a big, big chance. Played over, punched away. Aymar Oroz, magnificent challenge to win it back. So a throw in for Real Madrid. Rudiger, now Eder Meritao. On the ball, Rudiger. Chouameni. Rodrigo, a bit sloppy in possession. Likes to run with the ball at his feet. Oh, that's fine defensive play. And support available. Chance to put them in front. Marvellous anticipation. <laughs> Well, this is a big moment, and don't these fans know it? Who can he pick out? Well, too close to the goalkeeper to really pose a threat. Vinicius Jr. And Bellingham, Bellingham, and it's a goal! Despite their numerical disadvantage, they find themselves in front. Well, as you can see, not much power, but great accuracy. He made that look so easy, didn't he? rolling again 2-1 the score what's going to happen next Moncayola well the referee wasn't going to let that go cleared away comprehensively are being pressed here. Eder Militao. Rudiger has it. Now Eder Militao. Rudiger. Chouameni. And Bellingham. Eder Militao. 20 minutes to go. Tony Kroos. And now Rodrigo.
Crossing possibilities. Giving it a try. Well, the keeper in possession to prevent another goal from him. Well, he's a massive threat. That really could have been his second goal there. Well, Real Madrid are going to make the change now. Horse with the corner. What an important piece of defending. Corner kick delivery from Tony Kroos. And a goal it is for Real Madrid. They are on a victory course. Well, here's another look at it. Certainly delivery into the box couldn't have been any better. And it's a comfortable finish in the end, which is made to look so easy. It's a lovely goal. with the action and 3-1 the scoreline at the moment Ruben Peña Budimir with it and he stopped them in their tracks room to roam for the Merengues here Lucas Toro Moy Gomez. Moncayola. Will it be? Chance here. Oh, magnificent from the keeper. Fantastic stop. Given away by Real Madrid. Courtois. Rudiger has it. Federico Valverde. Eduardo Camavinga. The supporters want to see him have a go. Is it going to be? Excellent save from Thibaut Courtois. <laughs> And it's gone behind for the corner. Goalkeeper's ball, it was always going to be that way. Oh, good vision. Can he put it away? And a goal, it was served up on a silver platter for him. Well, here it is again. It's an easy finish in the end, but what was the keeper thinking? That's a poor bit of defending. Goals in plentiful supply. 4-1 currently. Moy Gomez. Good technique displayed. Big chance. Full marks to the keeper. Well, what a reaction from the goalkeeper. Such a good save in the end. And there's the delivery. Well, the post got in the way. And a good take under duress there.
That's a useful cross. Oh, such an elegant finish! How about that on the volley? A brilliant strike, whatever way you look at it. Well, here it is again, and what a perfect cross into the box this is. Just inviting someone to attack it, but from a defensive point of view, it's not good enough. They stop marking in the box and don't close the scorer down. That's just poor defending. Well, that's just what he wanted. He has to be happy with this performance. They've been good today. And that is that, the end of the game. It goes into the books as a win for Real Madrid. What did you think of their overall performance? You're absolutely right, Derek. Their attacking play was excellent, full of energy and pace, and the midfield completely dominated the game. It was a great all-round performance.